Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video and in this one we are going to be doing uh, probably, okay, basically this series, I'm thinking of making a series if I feel like uploading more, if I keep doing good. Um, we are currently whatever and whatever you guys will see. Uh, obviously we're in O because you know it's Rogue to James Worthy, why would I start out the series with a loss? But um, anyways, you'll see. Um, I just want to go ahead and get this out of the way. After this game that you guys are watching right here, I upgraded my squad a bit. I picked, I picked up Pink Diamond Allen Iverson, who for some reason is insanely just goaded. And I had a 45-point game with him against an all-Opal team. And it was pretty crazy. And uh, I just hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, an all-Opal team. You'll see what happened. Thank God the dude wasn't the best player in the world. But uh, as you can see, the man that just greened it right there ended up being our MVP in one of these games and the series is probably gonna be like a Chris move type thing where I just commentate over the games except you know the difference is my contents gonna be original his games are not original uploaded off the NBA <laughs> whatever I love Chris move but um what's it called yeah I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll see you in the next one all right so the first game a deep shot by Chauncey Billups to start the game you already know we had to drain that shot he's already pausing Easy, easy, Billups, again, green light, honestly, my favorite release in the game currently, I also really like, uh, what's his name, Hachimura, whatever his name is, and I really like Iversons a lot, and you'll see how much I like Iversons later, as we're just completely dominating here at the start on the boards and everything, and as you can see, the score is 17, or it was 17 to 24, I'm pretty sure it was like 17 to 19, uh, well, just keep in mind that he's at 17 while we're, we were at like 19, okay? 17, 19. Step back by Lamar Odom. Look at the score. It's increasing 31 to 17 as Giannis throws it down. Back to Lamar. Another step back, and that's going to be a 40 to 17, and you already know. He's going to get the five-second violation. We're going to do a step back, and he's going to quit. So, easy dub. And then we ran into this lineup. I was thinking this is about to be real easy, like... We about to win by 50 as Giannis throws it down hard on that dunk. But yeah, I'm thinking we're about to win by 50. And as you can see, we just start dominating. He just quits down when well, we were down 11. Later on, you're going to see why you don't quit. As we see this team and... Whew, oh my goodness! He had a whole team of 99 overalls. And I'm out here like, oh boy, we got to play our best as Iverson. Green's the three right away. And when I said we had to come out and play our best... I didn't mean Iverson come out and drop 50 points. Holy crap. I played good defense, but after that shot right there, rewind and watch that again if you want. After that shot, I was a little bit freaking out as I'm feeding Iverson. I liked the release that first shot we shot, so I kept trying to feed him. Obviously, it's working. We green with Avery Bradley. My team is filled with people I feel like I can green with, as everybody in the starting lineup I can definitely green with is Iverson. Three greens in a row, all from three. First three shots. Iverson throws it down, and he is currently four for four from the field, by the way. Obviously, as you can see, I'm trying to get it to Iverson. I'm trying to cook with him as we do a type of like curry play. Iverson doesn't stop moving. We bring him up. He comes all the way up, drives it right around T Mac, I think. Or yeah, there's a screen. We go all the way and lay it up and in. Iverson is honestly just dominating this game. And well, by this game, I mean pretty much the fourth quarter because. You guys are going to see what happens in the fourth quarter. Obviously, he's dominating here. He has 20 points in the second here. He, in the fourth quarter, he comes in with 20 points, as you can see in the top right. I think we're going to green with him right here off of like a sidestep or step back. Right there, yep, green. Easy green. And after that, I knew this fourth quarter was going to be domination by Iverson. As we do another little hop step thing. I don't even know what you call that, but that's the 2K cheese. Iverson, again. I think we're going to fire with him again. Pretty much every possession this quarter is Iverson as we green once again. This card is insane. I'm going to be honest. I know the Met is tall players, but man, if you can just pop an Iverson into your lineup, even at shooting guard maybe sometimes because usually the other team's point guard is taller than their shooting guard because 2K. But Iverson again, green, 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 green. <laughs> Obviously, we had to dish it there. We had a wide open three, I think, with Iverson, but... We had to get some dishes. We green one more three. That's going to be the last three we hit with Iverson. We dunk it one more time, and that's going to be 45 points. Near 50 points. And I see this team, and I'm thinking we might have met our match with Iverson. And, uh, well, let's just say this guy's a choke artist. 
this man is a choke artist. We're playing terrible at the start. Nice dunk. Before that, we were just rushing shots this whole game. As you see, I rushed a shot with Kurilenko there, but Thonmaker cleared up the board, so it was all good. I was really praying he did. Iverson, we throw it down here, and I'm thinking I'm about to get Iverson going. No, we missed like three shots with him. I'm pretty sure we went 0 for 5 in the first quarter with Hachimura, but uh, other than that one dunk that we saw by him, but other than that, we went 0 for 5. I think 0 for 4 from 3. Thonmaker dominating in the first half. He was the MVP of the game. He dominated in the second half, too. No spoilers, but he bricks that one. And as you can see, I'm not doing any cuts on this little play-by-play -play right here because Thonmaker is going to get his revenge. Obviously, you remember, he just bricked that three right there. You know, wide open three. Pretty good release. Thonmaker is going to choke on it. But Thonmaker gets the ball right back. No. Thonmaker, no. Thonmaker, no. No. Thumbmaker, no. Thumbmaker gets the ball right back. Green light. Splash. If I could do the Chris move. Splash. John Wall all the way. <laughs> Throws it down. I was going to do like a, you know, the old John Wall song, but for some reason it wouldn't let me download it. He doesn't take that shot with Iverson. Pretty dumb. You already know I wouldn't take that shot as John Wall throws it down again. And we're cutting into this lead. As you can see, 13 points still. We're down by 13 in the third. And well, there's two minutes left in the third, and you'll see what happens. We're down 13 with two minutes left in the third. Thonmaker and one. All of a sudden, the lead's cut from 13 to five in about, what, 30 seconds? Less than, way less than 30 seconds. And in a minute, guess what? Hajimura, bang. I'll let the clip do the talking. I'll let this clip do the talking. And we get our first lead of the game with that three by Chauncey Phillips. Our first lead of the game, John Wall throws it down once again. I don't think John Wall missed a shot this game. He shot four for four from the field. John Wall, crazy. And yeah, as you can see, I'm just going to get it to Chauncey. I think we're going to green this one right here. Easy green bean, Chauncey. My favorite release in the game. Larry Bird, you know, make both these free throws. I kind of got him back into the game because I always do that because I'm dumb because I want it to be like cool in my head. But as you can see, I purposely kind of tried to turn it over here by just running, hoping he would like catch it or something because, you know, like 0.3 seconds we're chilling. But we dub and um, I'm just going to flash the stats from Thonmaker and from uh, what's his name? Island Iverson here. I'm talking over the ending right here. I haven't added the screenshots in so. I won't be able to look at the stats, but if you can see John Walls right now, maybe it was before, maybe it's here, maybe it's after. Pretty sure he shot four for four, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.